This work here is a self-portrait that Picasso made in 1906. Um, it's one of his really iconic works that is uh, from the museum's permanent collection. Um, and it's a very kind of recognizable uh, face of Picasso. It's uh, one of the works that was made uh, in his first years in Paris. And he sort of has this very bold pose. He's dressed um, and standing almost like a boxer. Well, this is Picasso's Three Musicians, which has always been considered one of his greatest works. And it actually contains a self-portrait. This harlequin figure here is Picasso and he wears the colors of the Spanish national flag. And so it's a Cubist concept. And I think that the fact that Picasso used the colors of his national flag represents the fact that he was very proud to be Spanish, very proud of his Spanish roots, and it impacted his art throughout his career. Picasso liked to see the world very differently from the way that other artists had represented it. And Cubism was a way of bringing multiple perspectives and also to flatten everything. So you look, you look at the way that this arm is laid down. It's just like a piece of paper. He hasn't put any depth on it. But in a way, he felt that was more honest because, you know, in a way, to him, art was a lie that revealed the truth more clearly. He didn't like illusionism. He didn't like uh, the tricks of traditional painting techniques like chiaroscuro and perspective. He felt that this was a more honest way of, uh, a more exciting way of treating the world. When the Spanish Civil War broke out in 1936, Picasso was in Paris and he was deeply upset about what was happening, especially after Guernica. The bombing of Guernica really touched his soul. This print was made earlier. This was made in January 1937, but this one was made later after the bombing. And you begin to see these weeping women. Um, you see the kind of atrocities that were going on. And he really felt that what was happening in Spain was not only an assault on the Spanish culture and tradition, but something that the artists needed to participate in. And he encouraged people like Miro to also make political art at this time. And this print series is leading towards the great Guernica painting that he, he would make, decrying, really, human hatred. I mean, I'm a modern art curator, and in a way, Picasso is the beginning of modern art in the 20th century. And he's a wonderful way of looking at modern art because he not only had an impact on Cubism, as we see in this painting, but also later Surrealism. In fact, there wasn't really a modern art movement of the first half of the 20th century that Picasso didn't inspire or participate in. So he's a lightning rod for everything that takes place, and that's why building a show around him is, is so crucial. I would like to invite the Latino community to come and see this show, to look at Picasso and study his work and enjoy it. I think it's a wonderful day out and a very special exhibition, especially if you have Spanish blood like Picasso did. He was immensely proud of being from Spain. Mm -hmm.